Hi, I'm Ryan with Hatchy Time, and I'm going to show you how to build a small chicken plucker today. So these are the parts that come in the box. Your plastic drum, your rotating disc, your feather chute, the motor, seven screws, one bolt, and all your plucking fingers. So to get started, you put the plucking fingers in. So I've gone ahead and already put the beginning ones in, but to show you the last one, I'll do that right now. To save a little bit of time what you're going to do is put the finger through and then rock up and down and then come in from the other side and just pop it through you'll hear a little click and that means it's tight and secure and snug now some people put baby oil on it beforehand some people heat up the fingers a little bit you just want to make sure that it's in there very tight and secure so the next step we're going to put the plastic drum onto the motor and then take your feather chute, lift it up ever so slightly, make sure you get it on to the little pegs here. It should be sitting in those holes. Now gently place the drum back on. Next you're going to put the screws in around the perimeter. Next, you're going to attach the rotating disc. So you'll see on the motor, there's a little knob facing out. You're going to want to match the rotating disc insert the same way. So I'm going to tilt it this way and then rock it in. And then look through the little hole, line up the motor. Twist it around a little bit till you find the hole. And then push it down once you feel it inserted. Take your bolt, make sure it finds the thread, and finish it out by screwing it in. Now plug it in and turn her on.